Hi friends, Mr. Brian here, pronouns he and him, and I'm bringing you part two of our voice lesson. And before we do anything, I want you to make sure if you have it nearby, if not, pause and go get it, but get your water. I am thirsty, I am thirsty. And I know we talked about this last time, but I didn't explain. I wanted to make sure you stuck around for part two. Ha ha, you did. Fun fact, did you know we all have vocal cords? And I'm gonna share this screen right here, make sure I have the right one up. And I just want to show you an image of that because we talked about some other things here, but our vocal cords, I don't know if you can see my cursor right there, right about there, right about there. So we talked about breathing before and how important that was in our diaphragm and our vocal cords are that pink spot right there, right there. I'm going to stop sharing because you can pause on that. You don't need me pointing to it. And our vocal cords are very important because when we drink our bulk, when we drink water, our vocal cords don't actually get wet. If they did, we drown. And that's not a good thing. We don't want to drown, especially during class sitting up drinking water. But they are actually important because when we breathe from our diaphragm and bring up our vocal cords, vibrate, and we make our sound. So we want to make sure we are hydrated because it takes about 30 minutes-ish to get our vocal cords hydrated to be able to vibrate and produce sound. And we want to sit up straight, spine is straight, feet, hips width apart. And we want to make sure our head is upright, parallel to the ceiling, wherever the ceiling is, mine's at a diagonal, but it's still semi-parallel. And we want to review. So last week we talked about, or last time I should say, we talked about breathing and breathing from our diaphragm. Warning, warning, vocab. And it's a primary muscle, our diaphragm for breathing and has that dome-like shape. So put your hands on your belly, put your hands on your belly and take a big deep breath in, fill up like a balloon and hiss it out. We'll feel our belly get a little bit smaller. And we talked about, and breathe normal, breathe normal, my friends. We talked about phonation, and phonation is the creation of a vocal sound or vocalization. And an actor uses their voice to build character with these considerations from phonation. We talked about pitch. We talked about pace. We talked about, I should actually probably define them one more time for you. Pitch is the highness, the highness or lowness of your sound. We talked about pace, the speed of your speech, fast or really slow, uh, tone, how you might feel, your emotion, your intention, and your volume, your loudness, or your quietness. Today, what are we talking about? Good question. What are we talking about? We are talking about resonance and articulation. Can we all say resonance? Resonance. Can we all really stretch this out and say as clearly as possible, say articulation. Articulation. Thank you, I understood you perfectly. And one more time, who am I? My name is Mr. Brian, my pronouns are he and him. And I have some visitors here and I wanna introduce them. And I want you, my visitors, my friends, and you as well watching, I want you to tell me who you are. I want you to tell me your, if you would like to share your pronouns, and I want you to just give me one word, one word. It could be any word at all. And Miss, I should pass it to somebody. Miss Anna, why don't you start? My name is Miss Anna. My pronouns are she and her. And my word of the day is vivacious. Vivacious, love it. And over here somewhere is Miss... I'm Miss Madison, and I use she, her pronouns. And my word of the day is light bulb. Light bulb, vivacious light bulb. And uh, I'm going to have to give a word as well, I guess. So uh, I'm going to say electrifying. Electrifying. I'm going to write that there. And now I want to just to move around, get ourselves thinking about those three tools we actor, our body. Repeat after me, body. Body. Body voice. 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 Imagination. Imagination. Thank you, friends. And now I want to take the word, I want to take the word vivacious. And considering, considering choose whichever ones you want, the, the pitch, the highness, the lowness, the pace, your speed, your tone, your, your feeling, your emotion. And 
volume, how loud or quiet. And I want you to just say the word vivacious with your choice. So if you need to pause one more time, go for it. But consider pitch, pace, tone, volume. And I'm going to start and I'm going to pass to Miss Anna and then to Miss Madison. And then we're just going to go around a few times in the survey. All right. And Vivacious! <laughs> My turn? <laughs> Your turn. Vivacious! Vivacious. <clears throat> and now I want you to make a different choice. Make a different choice. Vivacious. <laughs> Vivacious. And now, my friends at home, I want you to make a choice yourself and let me hear you say the word vivacious. Nice. Interesting. I like that choice for the pitch. Very interesting. And now, that was just a setup because I have a part two to this. And I want you right now, let's channel our imaginations. Let's really just, I want you to think of a sound. I don't want a real word. I want a sound, any sound at all. Something that doesn't normally, no real words. That's all I'm gonna say, no real words. And give me a thumbs up, my friends, when you have a sound, a sound. Cool, cool. I should probably think of a sound too. Uh, all right. So what I want you to do now is we're gonna go in that same order. And I want you to give me that sound with a high pitch. We're gonna just go around a few times with a high pitch, with a high pitch. All right, and beep. Uh oh. <laughs> And now I want you to change it up. I want you to give me that high pitch, but I want to do it slowly. That high pitch slowly. And now give me that high pitch slowly, and I want you to do it as if you're really, really happy. <laughs> These voice lessons should just be us having fun. <laughs> And now I want you to do it really quiet, like almost like a whisper, but a loud whisper so we can still hear you. Still hear you. Hi, uh, slow, I'm sorry. Hi, slow, happy and quiet, quiet whisper. <laughs> And a little bit faster. A little bit faster. Okay, excellent. Give yourselves a silent applause. All right, all right. 
All right, my friends, I just wanted to get us out of there because we're now going to talk about, drum roll please, resonance. And resonance is, well, what is resonance? Your body actually creates a natural loudspeaker when we talk about resonance. Resonance is what causes those vibrations from your voice in your, into your body. So on lower pitches, the sound is going to vibrate maybe in your belly or your chest. The higher pitches are going to resonate in our head it's, which, it's probably why you, if you've ever heard the term your head voice, those higher pitches are in our head. So what I want to do now is, what am I talking about, Mr. Brian? <laughs> Let me tell you. Yeah, I don't know why there's some days, but today I'm going to try. So a resonance scan is what I want to try. So I want you to take just from your belly, take a nice deep breath. And when you exhale, I just want you to hum softly. I just want you to hum. So inhale and hum. And it's it's okay if I don't hear you. I just want you to one more time. Ex uh, inhale, not exhale, because you need to get some breath. Inhale, take a nice deep breath. And when you exhale, I just want you to hum softly. Mm. And I want you to feel resonance. I want you to feel that that vibration. Feel that vibration. Where is it coming out from? And so do that a few times at your own pace right now. I'm going to do it with you as well. It doesn't have to be at the same time. <clears throat> take a breath in. And just hum. And keep doing this because I want you to try and feel the vibe, different vibrations in your body. So take a big deep breath in. And when you hum, I want you to see if you can feel the vibration mm -hmm. in your head. Feel the vibration in your head, maybe in your face. Even isolate. Even if you feel vibrations everywhere else. I want you to see if you can really focus on the vibration in that spot. Your breath pushing, feeling that vibration there. Like a tickle a little bit there. And I want you to take another deep breath in. And I want you to hum and feel see if you can feel the vibration from your chest as well. And if it helps, put your hand on your chest as well. See if you can focus that isolation. And now I want you to see, tap your back, tap your back. And see if you can feel, just explore now. I want you in your different parts of your body, your back, your belly, as you're bre breathing in, just give a hum and see if you can isolate those vibrations, feel those vibrations in different parts of your body. Maybe your face, your chest. Oh, there's my belly. And now, let that go, let that go, shake that out, shake that out. I'm feeling relaxed. And what I want you to do now is we're doing something called a lip trill, a lip trill. And it's okay if you can't do this because some days I just can't find myself doing it. So what you're going to do is, let's see if I can do this sideways. And if you can't see me, my friends, let me know. But what you're going to do is you're going to take a, you're going to put your fingers right here, the side of your mouth. And this, what, this is what helps me. And you're going to push the sound so your lips shake and vibrate. So big deep breath in, and you're going to give me a. I got up. <laughs> when I'm on the spot, I can't, I can't seem to do it. This is just a lucky day, my friends. So one more time, take a big deep breath in. And if you don't need your fingers here, that's okay. Give me a. Roll out. And I want you to see if you can, so you got that vibration, that sound pushing out right there. I want you to see if you can go as high as you can as you push that sound out. So give me a. And I started, sort of started to do this anyway, but it's because you're gonna to start to feel that sound, that air pushing out. So as you're doing this, I want you to let go and push forward. So give me a high, big breath. And see if one more time now, fingers here to the side. I want you to see if you can give me the low push out. Give me a. <laughs> How you doing over there, friend? I want to see you do the low push out. So you at home, let me see you do the. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. And now I want you to see if you can give me a high to low with one breath push out. Give me a. 
And now, give me a roller coaster. Roller coaster. Give me a high to low. Give me a roller coaster of trill right now. I'm proud of that. I'm, I'm proud of that. Up and down, up and down. Give me a few times. Give me a. Excellent, excellent. And shake that out, shake that out. And now, just give me one big breath and give me a yawn. Give me a. And give me one more big yawn because we want to help release that tension in the jaw and our neck. Just give me a few yawns. Give me a. Nice, nice. Feeling relaxed. How are we feeling, friends? Yeah? Cool. Well, let's, let's do a little activity then. Let's do a little active. All right. We're going to do some Wizard of Oz. We're going to do some Wizard of Oz because I love this activity. And if you don't know the story, Wizard of Oz is about a brave girl named Dorothy. And she lives with her family and her dog Toto, Yaya. And they're in Kansas, and there's a tornado, and the house gets picked up and taken to this magical land of Oz, where she meets some friends. And we're going to learn how to make those, we're going to learn how to imitate those voices. We're going to learn to use resonance to make some different characters. So put your hands on your belly, on your belly. And I want you to just take a big deep breath in, fill up that belly with air, and I want you to say, and do as I do, ha, ha, ha. Oh, oh, oh. I want you to say, ho, ho, ho. Ho, 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 ho. And I want you to put your paws down low. I'm going to try and sit up a little bit here. Boom, chairs up. I want you to put those paws down low with that same belly voice. And we have a cowardly lion in our story. With that belly voice, I want you to put up those paws and with that belly voice say, put them up, put them up. Put them up, put them up, put them up. All right. And when I say cowardly lion, we're going to say, put him up, put him up, cowardly put lion. Him up, put him up, put, put him up, up, put him up, put him up. Just like that. Let me see yours, friends, at home. No, Dig you it. put him up. <laughs> <laughs> I want you to tap, tap your chest right now. And I want you to remember we talked about that vibration. I want you to tap that chest with it and give me a hum. Um. Sound is now going to resonate, shoot out from our chest. So now that we know where the sound's coming from, put your hands to the side. Put your hands to the side because our sound is shooting out from our chest. And I want you to give me a ha ha ha. Ha 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 ha. ha. Right, so we start to isolate it. So let's get more specific. Let's say ah ah ah. Ah ah ah. And we have a wizard, a very powerful wizard in this land. I want you to say, I am the great and powerful Oz. I, I am, am the great and, and powerful, powerful Oz. Oz. I believe you. I believe you. How about you friends at home? Let me see that. Let me see that powerful voice. All right. All right. I'll take you seriously. Okay. And now, my friends, I want you right now to put your finger right here on the bridge of your nose, right by your eye, right by your eye. And I want you to give me a, I want you to give me a hum. I want you to hum that sound so it tickles your nose. Oh, oh, my friends, not in your nose, but right here by your nose. Excellent, excellent. You could save that for later. All right, and now I want you to give me a hum. Hum. Very nice. And I want you to give me a nay. With that tickle. Give me a nay with that nose tickle. Me. And my favorite, I want you to give me a yeah. It's going to be N Y E H. And I want you to give me a push that up. Yeah. Yeah. And I want you to give me a I'll get you, my pretty. I'll get, get you, you, my pretty. pretty. And that is our wicked witch, our wicked witch that we meet along the way in the Wizard of Oz. And I want you right now to give me your most wicked, nasally voice on the count of three. And you too, friends at home, I want you to give me a, I'll get you, my pretty, on three. All right? One, 
two, three. I'll get you, my nice. pretty. Kitty. Excellent. Nice job. Nice job. I believe you. And now, from our head boys up here, I want you right now to put your hand on top of your head like that. I'm a good boy. And now I want you to give me a, I want you to float this sound above your head. I want you to give me a, oh. Oh. Would you give me a nice yawn? Give me a, ah. Oh. And now I want you to give me a nice, follow the yellow brick road. Yellow brick, yellow brick road. road. Why don't you give me a follow the yellow brick road? Follow the yellow, brick, yellow road. brick road. And one more time, because I want to say, give me that wicked witch. Give me a I'll get you my pretty, everyone. I'll get you, I'll my, get pretty. you my pretty. And now let me see that wizard of Oz from the chest. Give me a I am the great and powerful Oz. I, I am, am the great and powerful, and powerful Oz. Oz. Oh. Love it, love it. And can I see that cowardly lion one more time? Can I see that put him up, put him up in that belly? Put him up, put him up, put him up. And now my friends at home, I want you to choose. I want you to, from your head, from your nose, from your chest, from your cowardly lion, your belly voice, I want you to choose one at home. And I want you to give me one of them right now. I'm going to one, two, three. I am okay. the great and powerful Oz. I'll get you my pity. Nicely done, nicely done. Applause, applause, applause. And now, my friends, get a sip of water. Get a sip of water. Say hi, Jaya. And we are going to finish up with articulation today. Articulation. I don't know if you noticed at the beginning of class, you can rewind it or scroll back, but I specifically said articulation. Can we all just say that word articulation? Articulation. And we want to make sure that we make every word sound, every part of a word, every consonant clear. Good articulation means good diction, which means good pronunciation, which means, in other words, we are understood. Put your hand in the air if you want to be understood. I do. I do. And it allows the voice to travel loud and clear throughout any medium, meaning through a theater, through Zoom, with your friends. We want to be understood. So what I want to do now is I want you to reach into your imaginarium of your imagination and pull out a piece of gum. And I want you to take this gum and say, hello, gum. Hello, gum. And your most clear voice clearly make the gum understand you're going to eat them by saying, I <laughs> am going to eat you. I am going, going to, to eat you. you. Ha 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 ha. Ha 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 ha. And put it in your mouth. <laughs> and I want you to chew up. Really chew up. Get your whole face involved. I want you to chew down. I want you to chew up and down. Chew side to side. I want you to chew with your chin out. I want you to chew with your chin in. <laughs> I want you to chew as if it's stuck on the roof of your mouth. I want you to chew as if it's really sour. And take out that gum. And throw it behind you. It's OK. You signed a QSP waiver, so you'll be fine wherever it's stuck. All right, uh, please don't just stick it anywhere. Uh, anyway, we want to make sure that we're Only invisible nice magic warm. gum you can stick anywhere. Yes. All right, my friends. Okay. And last but not least, I want you just, since we're focusing on articulation, I want you to massage our different articulators. So right now, I want you to just massage your cheeks. Massage your cheeks. Massage your lips. Massage your lips. And we already started to do that with our mouth. So just really stretch your mouth in a circle. Stretch your mouth in a circle. And if one area needs more of a massage than others, focus on that right now. We just need five more seconds. Excellent. 
and now stick out your tongue ha, and point it down, ha, point it to the side, ha, and follow my finger, that one. Uh, in a circle going this way. <laughs> Other way. <laughs> and, all right, shake that out, shake that out. Now wipe off, wipe off. And now repeat after me. Yeah, I, I need another wipe too. Give me a ba. Ba. Give me a ba ba. Ba ba. Give me a ba ba b. Ba -ba -ba -b. Give me a bye be bo. Bye be bo. Bo be bo. Bo be bo. Give me a da. 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 Give me a da. 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 Give me a da da. Da da. 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 Give me a darling. You look marvelous. Da. Darling, you look, you look marvelous. marvelous. Give me a ga. Gah. Really stretch that out. Give me a gah, gah. Gah, gah. Gah. Give me a gah, gah, gee. Gah, gah, gee. And I want you to stretch this out. Give me a goo. Goo. And really get gooey with it. Give me a goo. Goo. Nice. Nice, friends. And now give me a ha. 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 Give me a ha, ha, ha. Ha, 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 ha. And give me a, put your finger right here. Give me a nah. Nah. Give me a nice nasally nah. Nah. Give me a nah, nah. Nah, nah, nah. Give me a nah, nah, me. Nah, 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 me. Give me a me. Me. Give me a me, me. Give me a nai ni no. Nai ni no. Give me a no no no. No 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 no. Get really close to the screen and give me a no no no. No no no. Warning, warning, I need you to channel your imagination. So right now, put on your thinking caps and I want you to channel your whiniest little sibling or imagine the sibling of someone else. I want you to get into your whiniest voice and I want you to say, no, no, no. No, no, no. no. Oh, nice. And let's play with some pitch as well as resonance. So give me a no, no, no. No, no, no. Oh, whinier than that, friends. No, no. Get even louder with our volume. No, no, no. No, no, no. All right, your awards for most whiniest will be in the mail. And now, my friends, I've lost track of what letter we're on. Ah, yes, give me a rough. Rough, rough. And remember, we're also able to channel character when we do this. So give me a, give me your lion. Give me a rah, rah. Give me a ra ra re. Oh, but you know, let's let's make the lion a little bit more of a scaredy cat. So give me a higher pitch and say ra re raggy. Oh, and now give me a really stretch that out. Give me a sa. Give me a sa. Give me a snap with that. Give me a sa sa. Sa sa sa. Give me a sa sa si. Sa sa si. And like you mean it, one big snap. Give me a saucy. 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 All right, friends. We're gonna do one more. Give me a wah. Wah. Give me a wah. Wah. And when you're doing this, your movement actually helps create the sound as well because something about our brains is connected to the sound coming from our movement as well. So give me one more time. Wah, wah. Wah, wah. And let's give, give me that low. Give me a wah, wah. Wah, wah. Give me a high wee. Wee. Give me a wah, wah. Wee. Wah, wah, wah. Wee. 
Nice friends, nice friends. And check that out, check that out, check that out. And I have two more things that I want to share with you. And then we are almost there. We are almost there. And I say that because I just want to make sure that I get this picture up as well. And these are some, what we talked about already, some areas of our head, our mouth, where we focus our articulation. So we have right now our lips, our teeth, our tongue. Those are the main areas. And sometimes we push out of our nose as well. So I just wanted to share that. Pause if you would like to come back to this. All right. And I already wrote this down. Whew. Take that information, pause, get some water, get a sip of water. And I put that down as a reminder on a daily basis. Lids are tricky, so make sure you're okay with your lids. And now my friends, my one of my favorite parts. And if you have one, Miss Ann and Miss Madison as well, cool. Um, I didn't ask. And you friends at home, if you wanna share as well, we're gonna do a tongue twister, a tongue twister. And what I want you to do now is, if you have one, think of it, think of it, write it down if you have to. And what I wanna do now is, I just want you to repeat after me. Repeat after me. Repeat after me. Repeat after me. Sorry, that Mr. Justin, you see that all the time and it got stuck in my head. And it was great. And now, I know, repeat after me, unique. 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 New York. New, New York. York. Unique New York. Unique, unique New, New York. York. New York is unique. New York is, is unique. unique. You know you need unique New York. You know, you know you need unique New York. All right, friends, let's be bold. I want to say it one time through, and I want you to repeat. Unique New York. Unique New York. New York. New York is unique. New York, New York is, unique. is unique. You know you need unique New York. You know, you know you need, need unique, unique, unique New, York. New York. Unique New York. New York is unique. Ah, you know you you need. Oh, no, I messed no, it up. No, no. Oh, man. All right, my friends. Do I want again, you all to try. All right. <laughs> unique New York. You. Yeah. Oh, my yep. gosh. I'm having trouble. No, I'm you having got trouble. It, you today. got it. You got it. You got it. Go, go, go. Unique, unique New York. New York is unique. You know you need unique New York. Ha! Yeah. Boom! Now your turn, friends. Unique New York. Unique New York. York. New York is unique. No, you know unique. you need New unique York. New York. All right. And you at home, try it out. Nope. Start over. Start over. Sorry. All right. I would have, yeah. There you go. There you go. There you warning! Go. Warning! You did it. <laughs> Fantastic. Fantastic. All right, friends, and there are many different uh, tongue twisters that we can bring to the table. And I, I'm sorry, I asked, and if anyone has a tongue twister that they want to share with the, with the rest of their class. How about rubber baby buggy bumpers? Oh, can you teach, can you, can you try to uh, show us, Miss Anna, one more time, rubber? Rubber. Rubber. rubber baby. 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 Buggy. 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 Bumpers. Bumpers. Rubber baby. Rubber baby. Buggy bumpers. Buggy bumpers. Rubber baby buggy bumpers. Rubber baby buggy bumpers. Cool. Rubber baby buggy bumpers. Rubber baby buggy bumpers. <laughs> Madison's showing off. <laughs> This not well, knows a lot of tongue twisters. <laughs> I love tongue <laughs> Um, Miss Madison, do you have one that you want to share? I didn't ask this before. Do you have a aluminum? Oh, aluminum. Linoleum. 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 Aluminum linoleum. Aluminum, aluminum linoleum. linoleum. Nice. How are you doing with that at home, friends? Try that out. Aluminum linoleum. That one's a hard one. Aluminum linoleum. Aluminum linoleum. 
I like how it uses like our whole, I got to exaggerate my whole mouth. Very nice. And that's the point. We want to be able to make sure we're nice and warmed up and stretched out. So that way we can be understood. All right. We don't have to do all of those, but whatever works, like when we find our resonance, we have to find the areas we want to make sure we really stretch and warm up. But um, that's it for this week. For next week, I have a surprise for you and you're going to see, and I'm going to let Miss Anna know as well, but we're going to do something where we're going to combine all of these things and we're going to do an activity as well. With, well, you'll see. All right, my friends, take a sip of water and let's check out real quick. My name is Mr. Brian and I'm, I'm, I'm feeling like I'm, I'm feeling good. I know that's not articulate enough, but I'm feeling really good. All right, let me pass it to Ms. Madison. <laughs> I'm Ms. Madison and I'm feeling um, loose. Loose as a goose. I'm Miss Anna and I'm feeling groovy. All right, my friends, put your hands in the middle. Put your hands in the middle. And I want you to say voice on three. One, two, three. Voice. Voice. Cool. We'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bye.